What is going on folks? This is the type of grind we're on. I just got done filming a reaction for my main channel. We pick the camera straight up off the tripod and go to the vlog channel. Today, I don't know, we might just be messing around. I think I'm gonna go to Walmart. I'm just gonna try to find something to, I don't know, either shoot, explode, or throw. One of those three. What do you wanna do today? Just lay on the back of the couch? Like a good dog? You a good dog? He's in rice. What's up with that mustache, son? What is your mustache doing? <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna head to Walmart. Pretty much been like in my daily routine to go to Walmart. Pretty much every day, I'm always there. Like at the end of the year, I'm gonna go through and see how much money I spent at Walmart. Then I'm gonna buy a ski mask and go take it back. <laughs> I'm thinking about a bow and arrow. I've shot bow and arrows before, but like I've never gotten like really good at it. And I've always wanted to like, you know, own one and actually be able to just like go outside and shoot it. Cause you know, they're not loud. You don't have to like go to a range or like have this big old property to shoot. And also just think it would be fun. We buy a bow and arrow, we get some targets. We can get like a two liter of coke we can shoot it make it explode or something get some like different types of fruits just have fun with it just hanging out in the backyard shooting the bow and you know maybe i'll fall in love with it i've never been deer hunting before in my life but you know maybe we get good at it maybe we want to take it deer hunting we are gonna get the cheapest bow and arrow they have at walmart and we're gonna test it so yeah let's head to walmart and let's go see what they got Alright guys, we just got home from Walmart and we got it. We got the good. Now, I hope y'all didn't click on this video hoping to see me buy a bow that you're going to take deer hunting because you're, you're not going to. Unless you pull this thing really, really hard and the deer is like 10 feet away from you, then you might hit it. I'm not saying you're going to get a kill, but you might hit it. But hey, this is time for the big reveal. For $30, this is what we got. Boom. There she is. Look at it. It looks pretty nice. The tan and black with the mossy oak camo. Come on now. But it is a mossy oak center shot compound for ages five through eight. So if you like add those together, it's still not my age. So that means it was meant for me. It was perfect. What y'all know about a 17 pound draw weight? I don't know how five year olds are out here pulling back 17 pounds. That's a lot of pounds. That's like 17 of them. Like if you got $17, that's like almost $20. That's a lot of money. 17 pound draw weight, 18 to 23 inch draw wing. I don't know too much about bows, but I have no idea what that means. Is that like how far you got to draw it back? Yeah. 23 inches seem about right. I'm just 6'2 with like a 6'8 wingspan, so yeah. <laughs> we got the bow. It came with two arrows and like this little cover, I guess. We'll open her up. Oh, yeah. Bro, this thing is nice for real. Jeez, nice. Boom. There we go. She's free. Look at this thing. This thing is nice. Come on now. For $30, bro. So we got the bow. It looks like a some type of case. I don't really know what this is, what this be doing. And then two mossy oak arrows. And also I came with this little thing. I don't really know what that is. Probably the instructions and stuff. Yeah, we don't need that. But bro, check it out. This is nice. <laughs> look, look how far I got to draw back. Hey, like I said, I'm not taking this thing deer hunting. This is strictly for me to blow shit up in the backyard. Also, I went ahead and picked up some more arrows. These are actually wooden arrows. These are like the cheapest arrows they got at Walmart. These are like two bucks a piece. Big wee wee alert. With me and not being able to shoot a bow, I figured we'd probably end up losing them. And I know I said I was going for the cheapest bow that they had at Walmart, but they had one that was literally for like two year olds. So I wanted to get something that I could at least shoot and have fun doing. So this was like the middle of the pack, the bow, $30. And then I bought the stuff that we're gonna be shooting. So let me show y'all that. So first off, this was the manager special. So I had to get it. $10 even, like they didn't even charge tax on this thing. That's how you know it's not. Boom. We got the whole block, like a professional foam block. Drew foam archery target. It was made in Arkansas. That's how you know it's for real. But it's got a couple different sides. It's got the big old buck on it. Head shot, uh, probably heart shot, and right in the ass shot. And then on the side, we got the old gobblers out here. Two little gobblers to shoot at. We got a whole ass grizzly bear. Come on. <laughs> and then on the other side, just some regular old targets. But for 10 bucks, let's see. We got one, two, three, four, five, six targets all on one foam block. We like balling on a budget around here. And this, this is it. So that is for like practice and getting, you know, my, my rusty old archery shoulder all warmed up. But now we get to the fun stuff. You know, it's October. It's fall. I got the flannel on. And for the culture, for the vibe, mini pumpkin, baby. We're going to set this baby up and we're going to make a jack-o'-lantern. But we ain't carving with a damn knife. Uh-uh. But yeah, we got the pumpkin to shoot at. And then to test my skills even more we got a can of bush light apple. drink responsibly kids hopefully i can shake this up and get a nice explosion out of it and then to really test my skills we got the old 
apple. We're gonna have Anna stand about 30 yards away and put this on top of her head. I'm gonna shoot this thing clear off. Like that one game on your phone everybody used to play in elementary school, like that archery game. Oh yeah, that's what we're doing that in real life. For the video, can we set an apple on top of your head and shoot it? No. <laughs> Never mind, I guess we're not. And then last but not least, that big finale we got for today's video. We got a two liter of Cherry Sam's Cola. We're gonna shake this thing up. I put it in the back of the truck on the way here. So hopefully it's nice and shaken up already. Yeah, look at the top. The top's already about to explode. We're gonna set this thing up and we're gonna shoot it and hopefully we can get a, like a really good explosion out of it. And if not, we're gonna shoot it anyway. But everything I just showed y'all equaled out to $52 even. So for $52, we got the bow and arrow, some extra arrows, a pumpkin, a two liter, a whole ass target. And then I had the bush light and the apple at home. But for $52, we are gonna have a good time and we're gonna get some practice in with the bow. So yeah, that's enough talking. Let's get this stuff set up. Let's get to it. Shooting into the wind a good idea? No. Sure. Oh. <laughs> I low-key don't know how to shoot this thing. <laughs> Alright, I'm pretty sure black goes up. And boom! There we go. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's get to shoot. All right, here we go. This is the first shot since probably like eighth grade archery, so like six years. Oh god, yeah. Oh god, yeah. I actually hit it. <laughs> That's a dead leg. <laughs> oh, hitting right in the knee. All right, let, let's let's do one more. This thing literally has zero power behind it. Did you see how wobbly it was? I can't believe I actually hit the hit the target though. How do you? Jesus. All right, well now now my confidence is up. Oh yeah, that, this is gonna be a dead bear right here. Even though I can't completely pull it back because it's a kid's, hmm, but we'll be all right. Oof. See what had happened was <laughs> when you release it, it doesn't really come off right. But all right, let's go check it out. I just got stung. Ow, motherfucker. Ow, ow, ow. I'd say that's a that's a limping bear right there. That is a limping bear. I bet you don't know nobody that can hit a bear right in the knee. Come on now. <laughs> and then the second one, I about murked the uh, the old GoPro. She's down here in the in the yeah in the grass. But for the first two shots, not too bad. I hit the target and almost hit the target. That's all you can ask for. Let me pull the bad boy out. Jeez, in right. Oh yeah, she he's a goner. Come on now. All right, round two. I'm gonna try one of the two dollar arrows this time, just to see if it shoots any different. It definitely will, cause it's actually like too fat to fit in this little hole right here. It'll be all right. We ain't worried about it. All right, clicked on. Here we go. I am Robin Hood out here. Come on now. Who, who's that? Black Widow? Yeah, not, nothing on me. The wooden ones might be the strat. Hold on. They're a little bit heavier. Here we go. Shot number two. Let's see if we can't get two on the board. Or at least just hit like one of the targets. That, that would be nice too. <laughs> nah, bro. It's over with. Y'all dudes out there bow hunting for deer, y'all are lucky I haven't got into it yet. Because if I was in it, all them deer would be gone. There'd be nothing left. Cheese and rice. Let's keep it going. All right, we're going to use one that came with the bow. Here we go. Can we go three for three? I think the wooden ones are the strap. Because that one didn't even make it five yards. Hold on. If this one doesn't hit, I'm, I'm using the wooden ones. Okay, it hit the bottom of the target. If I go three for three on wooden ones, yeah, that we're using the wooden one. Come on. <laughs> Let's go check out the damage. So there's the target. There's where this other arrow went. Literally like five feet away. But check your boy out. Yeah, I might have missed. But look at the grouping. Come on now. Listen, his back leg is messed up. They ain't got him in the cankle and the knee. He is one limping ass bear. And then the other one that came with it, barely missed. So I'm thinking the wooden ones are the strap. But let's flip this thing around and let's see if we can't hit a deer. Now that I'm looking at it from over here, the deer is tremendously smaller on this than the bear. Which makes sense because bears are pretty big. So we're going all out on this first shot. Using the wooden one because I have confidence in this for some reason. So here we go. This is actually a pretty long shot. 
We got a deer about 20 yards away. Big old buck. The type of buck that everybody's going to share on Facebook. I'm going to be on the front page of the newspaper. If y'all don't do that where you're from, I guess I just might be country. Because literally, there could be a murder and somebody win the lottery. But if you shoot a big ass buck, you're being on the front page of the paper. And he's right there, right there in the backyard. He thinks my GoPro's food. Let's smoke him. It went right in between the rack. He didn't even notice though. We got one more shot. That wasn't a bad shot though. I was aiming a little high because I've been noticing they've fallen down. So I'm just gonna aim right on it and see what happens. A little low. <laughs> Listen, this deer ain't scared. This deer ain't scared at all. He's just standing there watching me at this point. Standing broadside and everything. He's like, here, I want you to hit me. So we're gonna get him right here. Let's watch this. Missed again. <laughs> All right, that's enough that he don't ran off. He realized I was ass and was like, yeah, you don't even deserve it. So on the little thing, I was aiming dead center right here. And uh, I don't know if it's too, uh, she's real sighted in or not. I was about a foot high, a foot right, and two feet left and down. So I say she's dialed in. All right, Anna's back to her injury, from her injury. So. I hate nature. <laughs> so she's gonna try to shoot one. We'll see. Over it. it was close though it's been a long time since i shot one <laughs> you you shooting it look a lot better than me shooting it because <laughs> it actually fits you i'm a kid <laughs> <laughs> oh god i can't even aim with this thing i went over it that was close see this thing yeah that's where i've been i've been putting whatever i'm aiming at in between that that's what i just did go down a little bit then Yeah, you're way high. <laughs> Boom! See how high you are, though? <laughs> oh, did it's it hit you? Yeah. yeah. Not bad. Shoo! You hit, you hit his back hairs. You faded that boy up. Yeah, he still ain't dead. Cheese and rice. I hit it, though. Not bad. Good job. This thing shoots low as hell. I don't know. If you ask me, it's low. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, now I faded him up. This one's going for the head. Or the front paw. Why not at least hit one of the targets? I crossed it. We trimmed his toenail and hit him in the cankle again and faded him up on the back. But we're hitting the target, so I think we're ready. You got this one crossed. Yeah. Cross this one. You're a natural. Oh, yeah. Boom. There we go. It's almost Halloween. We gotta get in the in the spirit. So, all right, here we go. I don't know how cool this is gonna be. We also got it sitting down there by our end table that used to be in our house. Yeah. Yee. <laughs> Jacko, this bitch. <laughs> you see, <laughs> when you buy. A kid bow. There's only 17 pounds of force coming off of it. And you buy a freaking pumpkin that has upgraded armor, I guess. She bounces right off. That's gonna look cool in slow tip. motion though. <laughs> you broke the tip. Huh? The tip flew off. Let me see. It did. Are you serious? I'm dead ass. Wait a minute. No, I hit it. I hit the freaking the stem. That's why. I hit the hardest part on the damn pumpkin. I'm telling you, it's around here somewhere on the ground. No. I seen it fly off. No, the tip's still on there. Well, then what flew off? Oh, the piece the of the pieces. yeah, the piece of the thing. All right, all right, that makes me feel better. See, I thought I hit that just the regular pumpkin. I was like, this thing, <laughs> this is the hardest damn pumpkin there was. I was wondering why these damn things were on sale. <laughs> Shit. Yeah, it would probably also help if I had got like a sharp tip. Yeah. She she rounded. So all right, we're gonna try the one that came with the bow this time. I can't believe it bounced off like that. What the hell? Damn, it ruined my catchphrase. I was thinking of that for a while. I think it was something else, something else badass to say. A pumpkin your spice. Oh, okay, I'm gonna act like I, I came up with that. Right? Okay. I'm a pumpkin your spice. About took out the GoPro. All right, round two. I gotta stick with the wooden ones. The, the ones that came with it are not it. Those are not it. Trick or treat? No, I think it's a trick. Let's scoot up and I'm gonna edit it like we didn't move. Okay. okay. Boo, bitch. 
Let me try. Listen. I, I, I can get this. Hang on, one more. Is it personal? It's personal, wow. <laughs> if I don't get this damn thing, I'm gonna go back, return the bow, and buy a goddamn shotgun or something. Alright. I'm out of catchphrases. Don't show them how bad I missed. All right, run it back. October 5th. God damn it. <laughs> you Technically, you hit it. You just hit the stem. Yeah, but it looks cooler if I stick it in there. Ooh. Ooh. See? Boo, bitch. <laughs> Let's go. There we go. Oh god yeah. Oh yeah. Ooh. Ew. <laughs> what does it smell like? Loki smells like pickles. What? I don't know. Alright, we got one eyeball, now we gotta get another eyeball, and we got pretty much got a face. I can't believe I got that like second try. That's wild. <laughs> <laughs> I think I actually learned how to aim it though. That was gonna hit, but it literally like went wobbly in the air. Hey. Man, I'm a sniper. Third try. Gee. <laughs> I'd say that's a that's a carved pumpkin right there. Yeah. Yeah, I've seen people win like pumpkin carving contests with stuff that looks like this. Alright, well yeah, we, we got the pumpkin. She gone, done, did. All you gotta do is put a candle in it. It's ready. So now let's move on to literally probably never gonna hit it, but let's move on. Alright, I couldn't I couldn't think of nothing cool to say. <laughs> this one's for all my alcoholics out there. You don't need to go to those AA meetings. Go to Walmart, buy you a $30 bow, and get you one of them beers that's ruined your life, and shoot the sucker. All right, listen, if I hit this, you gotta like subscribe, like the video or something, cause it just took me literally like 50 shots to get the damn pumpkin. This is like a fraction of the size of that. I just hope I hit it and it actually goes through and it does something cool. All right, here we go. That was close, I hit the table. I gave you 20 bucks. $20? $20. I right, bet. I couldn't even see that one. It's so hard to aim this thing. Like you aim one spot, you hit it, then you aim another spot and it's completely off. <sighs> it skimmed it. All right. Yeah, that's a northwest wind. <laughs> this is perfect. Oh my God. I'm so close. Like you would think they'd make this easy for kids so like they could hit shit. Then they fall in love with it and then spend thousands of dollars on the big one. Or not even the kids, a 20 year old that thinks he's a kid. Mm. Bush light, more like no more life. I just go up there and stab it with the pocket on it. <laughs> I don't need to, cause I'm freaking Robin Hood. Smell what? Yeah, it smells. It's now it smells like an AA meeting. <laughs> Cheese and rice <laughs> on the fourth shot, too. What the? <laughs> <laughs> it went everywhere. You destroyed that can. I hope my dad's not watching this. The amount of metal I just got in my mouth. Well, let's go! That, I finally hit it. Now the entire arrow, a wooden arrow, is gonna smell like bush apple for the next year and a half, so. Gross. Moving on! We're going to the finale. Listen, the apple on Anna's head, she done said no. And I never hit it anyways, uh, so. Yeah. Cherry Sam's Cola 2 liter. 88 cents at Walmart. You might want to stand behind the truck when I shoot this. Because if I hit it, it's most likely gonna just bounce off, because this is... Yeah, so. Uh, it, this is a bigger target, though, so. Maybe. And I just, oh, I might not have, all right. You might have screwed up. Yeah, shaking it like that, it just made this a lot harder, so. It might just bounce off. 
Let's get it. I'm using the one that's soaked in beer because it's my lucky charm now. This is good. This can go a couple different ways here. A one, I can just keep missing and missing. And we just never hit it. And I end up just throwing it on some concrete and watching it shoot up like a rocket. Or I hit it, it explodes. Super cool, nice B-roll, nice slow motion from the GoPro, and we end happy. Or I shoot this thing, it bounces off, comes back, hits me in the eyeball. Then this is a very good title, not clickbait. The more I talk, the more I feel like I want this thing to bounce back and hit me. <laughs> I just pray it hits you, not me. I've already been stung by a bee. True, true. Took one for the team, I'll take one for the team, I guess. Here we go. Two liter of Sam's Cola. Cherry my nuts. I'm, I'm scared. <laughs> Back up. I'm, I'm, I am scared because I feel like it really is just going to bounce off. Trained professionals, don't try this at home. Don't, just don't do it, okay? I did, I'm doing it. I'm trained. I'm a professional. Don't do this at home. Sam's Cola, more like Sam's No. <laughs> First shot. Hang on. Let me put two in it. Let me put two in it. Hang on. <laughs> oh, come on. Hurry up. Hurry up, she's just, she's just leaking, come on. And that one bounced off, okay. <laughs> it's just slowly it's leaking. It's just slowly going. That really was first try. That was first try, like for real, no <laughs> cuts or nothing. God damn. I would hit it first try than not hit it again. I think it's gonna leak out anyway. What the hell? I mean, that's cool though. Ah! <laughs> oh damn! <laughs> Just smells like beer and cherry cola. That didn't work. Nope. Didn't go as planned, but I mean, hell, we hit it. I say, I say we hit her. You want to swig of this? Yeah, let me move the 600 pieces of grass on it. Ew. We even like cherry coke. Hey, that ain't bad for real. I'm just gonna throw this back in the fridge. Tastes like beer. No, I feel like I need to brush my teeth instantly after drinking this. <laughs> Let's see. What, I want, I want one more shot. I want one more shot. What the, what type of shit? What, what now it's indestructible? This is the one I hit the beer with too. This is the lucky one. This is my baby. Ew. What the fuck? Why, why do you let me do this thing? Well, I thought it was my lucky one. I guess not. Shh. Every time I'm on the ground right here, I get a cramp. What is going on? Oh, my phone. Got him. <laughs> Are you sure I can't put the apple on top of your head? You see me, I got all those pretty much like first shot, so. I've already been stung by a bee. I think I'm gonna sit this one out. What hurts worse, a bee or an arrow? Fine, fine. <laughs> but all right, guys, that is going to do it for testing the cheapest Walmart bow and arrow. If y'all want to see more content like this, there's hella stuff I can buy from Walmart. And we can just mess around in the backyard like this, blowing stuff up. Maybe we buy an actual pew. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. It, it'd be cool. Y'all let me know what y'all thought about this video down in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching. Shout out to Anna for getting stung by the bee and still being the cameraman. Respect. You still <laughs> owe me $20, though, so... Listen, workman's cop, I'm taking it back. Run me my money, honey. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much. Peace. Have you ever heard of a uh, arrow roulette? Did you know? No. no.